this lesson is about summary of factoring in pre-cal level. When you factor a polynomial, you have to make sure your polynomial is in standard form, and then make sure the leading coefficient has to be positive. If it's not a positive, we have to take the negative sign outside. Then, you, after you set up the polynomial in standard form, the first step is always JCF first, which means you have to look for a greatest common factor first. After that, just check how many terms your polynomial has. If it's two terms, just check is it this three format. If it's not this three format, that means you stop factoring. It's uh, you cannot factor your polynomial now. If there are three terms in the your polynomial, then just check is it a quadratic function format like this, a x squared plus b x plus c, or is it twisted uh, quadratic function like uh, this one. And sometimes it could be, we call this is the perfect square of uh, sum or difference, like this. If there are four or more than four terms in your polynomial, you can use the grouping or synthetic division to factor the polynomial. Now let me talk about GCF. GCF, greatest common factors. How can you find the GCF? First, check just check the numbers. If you have like four, six, then the GCF is a two. You learn this in your elementary school, so pretty easy to find out the GCF for numbers. GCF for variables will be the variable with lowest exponents. For example, if you have x third power, then x sixth power, and x like a fifth power, the GCF will be x to the third power. Always look for the lowest exponents. Let's use this rule to uh, factor the following polynomials. The first one, GCF for 50 and 80 is 10. So I take 10 outside. Original polynomial divided by 10. So I will get parentheses 5x minus 8y. Then check 5x minus 8y is not those two terms format to factor. So then I'm done. This is the final answer. For second problem, this is a standard form, but the first uh, leading coefficient is negative. So first step is I will take negative outside. When you take a negative outside, don't forget change the sign. So I will get this 32 n to the ninth power minus 32 n to the 6, then minus 40 n to the 5th. Then the common factor I could say for 32, 32, 40 is 8. The lowest exponents for n is 5, so I take 8 n to the 5th power outside, then I do divide. 32 divided by 8 is 4. Then n to the 9th divided by n to the 5th, we subtract the exponents. I got the n to the 4th power. Minus 32 divided by 8 is 4. n to the 1st power. Then minus 5. Then I check for my uh, factoring, this is the uh, three terms left. For these three terms, it's not those quadratic function format. So I cannot factor this. Then this is my final answer. 
Let's go to number three. For number three, we can check the uh, JCF is four x to the third power. Why is not the um, JCF? Because for my second term, I don't have y. So I divide. A divided by four is two. And x third power divided by x third power is gone. So I have y squared left. Plus, 4 divided by 4 is 1. x third power divided by x third power is 1. Then I check this 2y squared plus 1 is not those two terms that we can factor. So I stop here. This is my final answer. Let's go to number 4. GCF for 27 and 72 is 9. GCF for variable x is x squared. And for the y, it's a y squared. This is the lowest exponents. So I take these two outside, x squared, y squared. That I do divide. 27 divided by 9 is 3. x squared, x squared is gone. y to the fifth power divided by y2 is y squared, y third power. Minus 72 divided by 9 is 8. x third power divided by x squared is x. y squared divided by y is gone. So let's check these two terms. 3y third power minus 8x. It's not those two three forms to factor. So this is the final answer. In a word, when you factor polynomial, you have to uh, check GCF first. After GCF, you have to check your factor, the polynomial, can you keep factoring? And uh, then check it. In a word, when you factor a polynomial, you have to uh, factor GCF first. After that, you have to check, can you keep factoring until you know you can factor the polynomial completely? That's all.